They're the gifts that, if the state government has its way, will soon keep on giving. New legislation is set to go before Parliament to stop gift cards expiring too soon. It's said every gift from a friend is a wish for your happiness. But for Gabriel Smith, she wishes her friends had never given her or her family gift cards. It had expired by two weeks and the health club would not honour that. Gift cards are now a $2.5 billion national market, around 34 million sold each year. But many complain the cards often expire before they are used. And now the New South Wales government has become the first in Australia to propose legislation for a three-year minimum expiry period on all gift cards. We've got Christmas coming up. Uh, there's a lot of shoppers that will be out there buying ca uh, gift cards, but making sure also they know that they're going to get what they paid for. It's great news. It means you have one consistent standard and consumers just know their rights. Maya, DJs and JB Hi-Fi have a lifespan on their cards of two years, while other big-name retailers such as Westfield have a 12-month limit. Many smaller retailers, such as beauty salons, can have an expiry period of as little as three months. The new legislation that will be introduced into the Parliament as early as this week will also focus on the hidden costs of gift cards, purchase fees and service charges. Post-purchase charges that reduce the value of gift cards, standard gift cards, will be outlawed under this proposal. You're expending so much energy in trying to convince people that, to do the right thing. I tell my friends, please don't buy me any more gift cards. Mike Dalton, 9 News.